Okay, friends, so we are back with Creeper World 4. Probably gonna irritate myself some more, but here we are with the compound. Something needs protecting. Sure, why not? Uh, there's a buried device or artifact on this world. The device is broadcasting a weak signal using a known protocol containing an ID and metadata. Metadata is indicative indicative of uh, information storage containing encrypted data the holy language of the ancients much as you are holy and this is, vessel is holy the cache is also holy we must retrieve okay. sentry drones detected used only to protect high value assets defense only established base of operations then conduct assault units within range of sentry drone will be destroyed Destroyed sentry drones. Destroy sentry drones from a distance with snipers. Sad have I been. Our actions have not been in accordance with peaceful intentions. I know things must be done that must be done, but we should always consider the alternatives. For that, I have added anti creep anti creeper messengers to our abilities. They are bombers, but with a better message. We are all different, but the same. Use these anti-creeper messengers, and we may yet establish a dialogue. Neat. Okay. Also useful. So, we got anti-creep bombers. Got emitters, totem emitter. I don't see centuries though. I don't know what he was talking about with those exactly. AC Bomber Wing, like it. Okay. So, name of the game. We go. Ham. On bombers. Obviously, ACs. Not what I wanted to do, but that's okay. Let's bring our factory into here. things. Anyway, let's go ahead build up, what, missile defenses? Do we need them? We got one missile spitter. That should be sufficient then, but we'll put one back here just in case. Let's see, uh, miner, yes. And then we'll need a factory, of course. And uh, this majigger. Along with um, the turp. Digging these sons of bitches out. Alright, so let's see what we got here. We got a terrain height of 7. Let's go ahead and see if. That's enough to get those out of there. I don't know. We'll find out. Oh, they are pouring in fast. Oh, are they pouring in fast? Okay. So, let's go ahead and place... 
a series of cannons there. It'd be good if these were high priority targets. And we're fucked. Come on, get her built. Get her built. Get her built. Get her built. Took her jeebs. They done took her jeebs. So we got we got our bombers. Let's go ahead and see what they can do. Yeah, seriously. Fucking horse shit, I swear to god. Let's try this again. Why don't we go ahead? And do something along these lines. And then we will go ahead. We will set up missile defenses for each area and then we will go ahead and set up sniper defenses for each area might be going a little overboard on that but I could give no fucks Let's see, mine, and then mine. All right, that's probably overkill. It's not overkill enough, I'm not sure. Okay, weapons, weapons, weapons. What do we got here? Let's go ahead. Plug in some more weapons. We got missile batteries running. We will need a turp there and there to excavate. Let's go ahead and do build speed. And then we will need what? A runway of AC bombers, which we can put on this side. Keep them out of the way. That'll 
that'll do. That'll do. Good shit. Alright, so we got that out of the way. Doesn't look like actually any of them are buried. Well, alright then. Let's go ahead and build the micro machines. What's that about? Blue white is needed. Let's see what they can do. Sure how effective though. I'm not even sure where the hell to go with this next. This is a right fucking nightmare. This is a goddamn nightmare. And I'm I'm honestly not sure what to do about it. Like, where do I even begin with this one? Uh, Alright. Let's see. So if we go ahead... It can't even reach... So then we have to do what? Porter. Do we put a sniper up here? What's up? We can't put a sniper there, we can't put a porter, or we can't put a porter block in place. What can we fucking do? What can we do? Hold on a second, let me figure it out. Okay, I have a plan, I don't know if it's going to work. Seriously, what the shit is that? If I blow up bullshit, I don't expect to have to deal with it still dealing, dumping creep on my shit. Seems reasonable. To me, anyway, seems pretty damn reasonable.
Okay. So here's the game plan, right? We build a porter. We're going to build a second porter. One for energy, one for... Arg. Oh, god damn it. Seriously annoying. Seriously, seriously annoying. Very annoying. As I was saying, what we're going to do is we're going to build a shield. What else are we going to build? We're going to go ahead and place that in here. And this in here. Actually, can I build a nullifier up here and have it hit? I can build it there. So what we're going to do is we're going to go Okay, now let's see what I was talking about with uh, regards to the sniper bit. Okay, stop that please. Just wasting resources. We need to kill these little shits. Somehow. Send them to here. I don't know if they'll actually be able to land and do. Okay, they are able to land. But they do not get energy fast enough to continue handling it. deal with this. I can't put Sniper there. I've tried. It's kind of annoying, to be honest. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, not how I want to do this, but how I will do this if I have to. but fine. Ah. 
God damn it. No, I can reach a good majority of it from there, so that's positive. Wasting my energy, please. Silliness. Keep bombing them. Come on. If we can get these platforms built, we can build the snipers. Well, we gotta build them on both sides is the problem. So one side done. We'll get this side done. Gotta get this side done. Which I do not believe will have an easy access a door.
unless I go ahead and uh, make one. And uh, like that. And then uh, if it would ever like to actually build up the things that it's uh, supposed to build here, uh, we could finish it up. And that'd be great too. A lot of crackly noises going on. I don't like it. through really what is that why is that happening Is that and why is that happening? Super duper annoying. Thing of, I don't think I need to build them down there. Let's start here and see what happens, right? them to get through is is the goal here I don't want that damn thing cleaned up Yo, yo, that thing for real? Did it really just run across a line of turrets like a dick? That really just happened, by the way. Yes, it fucking did. Twice. It has now happened twice. Color me not amused.
Yo, how am I supposed to stop their bullshit? Seriously. Okay, so now back to my original goal of trying to get rid of these sons of bitches. Using my cheese tactic that is not so cheese because it's taking way longer to accomplish than it ever probably should have. So if that holds true, that means that one should be done, and we should be good. No more assistance from the bombers needed. And we can move on to the next. Same deal here, two porters. Okay, so special building. Make it some ARG. Plug that right there. We'll plug that right there. fire as far out as we can get it. Didn't hold. I either need more bombers or I need to do a different tactic because that did not hold as it should have. As I was expecting it to hold. Let's see, weapons, nullifier here is good. Should put it inside the shield. I guess it's just gonna blow up no matter what the fuck I say. Real, real 
tedious a level. So if we can now get to the next one, hopefully that'll start to slow little sons of bitches down. But I apparently should not count on it, as they cannot keep them charged. Entirely. Oh, what do we got going on here? This is too much bullshit. plan. How many more we got? We got three more assholes pumping out a shit ton. A literal shit ton. Alright, let's see. We build it here. We build Porter. We can destroy them. And I'm out of power. Okay. How did the nullifier get blown up? Seriously. How does the nullifier keep getting blown up?
Okay. Okay. So I feel like I'm trying to be too creative again. trying to be too creative again. generation out the ass. That only gets us eight. fucking long now. I can't even put a dent in it.
Hopefully that'll stabilize. Because I'll be damned if I have any idea otherwise. We'll go ahead and just do this. Take every advantage I can get. that kind of bombing underway. We can hopefully put another nullifier in here. And start to stem the tide of bullshit. I hope. Because if we can't, I got nothing. This son of a bitch down now. We only got one more son of a bitch to lock down. Fucking sake. <sighs> Lost her handle on it. Need some fierce. Holy shit. These cockroach sons of bitches are a pain in the ass.
Okay, we got a handle back on it. Let's rebuild the Nully. Today, maybe? Finally, fuck. This is a workout, really. Build in all the damn redundancies again, I guess. Space I can get my hands on too. Just to get as much energy gen as I can. Okay. Starting to pull ahead slowly. Oh my God, this was ridiculous. Okay, with those done and out of the way... We can now go and retrieve this bullshit. Which I assume is... I don't know... A few levels down? Data encrypted, authorized access only, enter decryption fast freeze. Hey kid, did you ever actually purge that system gash? I'm not sure your grandfather would approve of such sloppy work. How, what, Director Hale? Uh, pass freeze. Dr. Hale's an idiot? Hey kid, I guess you were wondering how a message from good old Dr. Hale ended up an alien info gash on some strange and remote world. I always prefer direct answers, so here goes. First, this isn't a remote world, it's Mars. 
You never left Mars. Yeah, I know. Each world you visited had appear appeared different from the last. It's because you've been hopping through time, not through space. With each rift jump, your rift engine has a flaw. There's a compensation factor that is necessary. All of the details are in this info cache. It'll be a simple integration. What's important for you to know is uh, that we came after you. After those meteor strikes and the creeper arrived, we took shelter under underground and survived. Once you jumped, the creeper disappeared as fast as it arrived. And I'm sure you've encountered terrible amounts of creeper in your travels so far. We rebuilt the program after you left, built a new jump vessel, and came after you, or so we thought. We too jumped through time, e through time. Each time we landed on what we thought was a new world, but eventually came to realize was Mars at different ages. After many jumps, we landed in a time when Mars was populated. This, it would turn out, was an incredible stroke of light. luck. You see, history of our galaxy is that civilization emerged, human civilizations. Each grows to greatness in one form or another. Then the creeper arrives and destroys almost everything. Then there's a period of chaos and desolation. The random survivors on a few scattered worlds slowly rebuild civilization over a millennia. Sometimes they start from the Stone Age. These periods of darkness are long, and the periods of galactic civilization are always short, very short. The creeper seems drawn to complexity. So once a civilization is vast and complete, the creeper calls it. So to land in a time where a civilization at its peak is one in a million, but land in one we did, and we learned much from the people of that time. We learned about a flaw in our rift engine, and that it seemed and that it seemed like an intentional design. We can thank your grandfather for that. We learned about history of the people we came to know, but more importantly, they learned from us. We were, f we were from what they called the original world, Earth. For them, it's a myth. Little did they know, Earth was the third planet in the very system we arrived in. Word quickly spread of our arrival. Scientists came from all across the galaxy to study and talk to us our biology, our historical, rec our historical records, and our technology. Once they studied us, they were able to piece together the story of the, se of the galaxy. They weren't the second civilization. They were hundreds of galactic c there were hundreds of galactic civilizations before them, each scattered and ruined. But I digress. Yeah, exposition fucking island. Kid, we looked for you, but it's clear we would never catch you. Each time we took... Each jump we took always put us behind you in the temporal timeline. So we did the next best thing. We created this info cache and placed it here on Mars. We built this compound to protect it for as long as possible. We knew the time in time the creeper would come, but we learned that some things would survive the creeper, and we hoped this would be one. It was the best we could do. If you're reading these words, it worked. What's important is what you do now. You have a choice. You should arrive after the fall of my civilization. How long it's been, I can't know for sure. But you are in a, in a desert between civilizations. So your choices are you can correct your ref engine and stop hopping through time. Or you can keep jumping through time and take your chances with what you might find. Perhaps you too will eventually land in a civilization near its peak. So I'm assuming you're thinking going home isn't an option. Yeah, that's right. The best you can do is make a new home. I'm long gone. Everybody you know has been gone for countless years. Everything that mattered, hundreds of galactic... hundreds of gal galactic generations is gone. Okay, but there has to be one more thing, Director Hales, and one more thing to consider. Oh, one more thing. If you do decide to stay in this time, there might be a way you can shorten the interim till the next civilization and give the survivors a leg up against the Creeper. It won't matter for you, but for whatever civilization comes next, it would make a big difference. I've left info caches on three worlds. Combined, they contain the sum total of everything the civilization learned. They contain the totality of history of galactics. God damn, this is fucking ridiculous. Why did you put this all in one fucking mission? Caches are separated over in three worlds, too much in any one place, and the creeper would have taken it. The coordinates of these worlds are included in this info cache. If you take up this challenge, you will need to copy the info caches and then visit visit as many worlds as possible, seed the word with a copy of the caches, help the survivors you might find, 
In time, if even one of your caches is found, it can make the difference. Lastly, Danu, I never had children, but you will, you will always be my kid. Now go get it done. Jesus fucking Exposition Island. Ay, 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 ay. They broke it. Okay, they broke it. Unacceptable. Tame that son of a bitch down, please. Thank you. Okay, so... Let's send them to where? Here? Let's send them to there. Actually, let's just do that. Let's send them all... Right to this fucking guy. So that is what I was afraid of. Just Eggapalooza down here fucking shit up. Oh, come on, fuck off with that. There's absolutely no reason for them to have that much of a creeper explosion. What is that? What is causing this right here. This fucking thing's gotta go. So goddamn sick of these fucking sons of bitches. Can I possibly get down onto the ground, please? Is that at all possible? Can we do that? Thanks. Douche. This thing has got to fucking go. Oh yeah, yeah, it's gonna be irritating all the way to the end. Of that, I have absolutely no fucking doubt. Seriously, what is causing these explosions of bullshit? Fucking over it. I'm so fucking over it. I don't know what's causing it, but I'm done with it. I'm not having it. Go fuck itself. I mean, I learned where it's gonna do it, so... Get fucked, thing. Oh. My. Fucking. God. Seriously, thing, you need to get fucked. I am so fucking sick of this shit. I swear to fuck they designed it just to potentially be as tedious as possible. There's no other alternative for why 
It's so goddamn obnoxious. Almost there. Almost fucking there. these last two and we're out. Let's build a little faster, please. nullified. Let's do it. It's like, mm, you almost got it. I'm not gonna go attack something else. I'm just gonna go attack that thing you're trying to build. things have I not controlled yet? Now, I didn't realize I could do that, otherwise I fucking would've. Get the refinery built. And now let's find these towers and uh, plug them in. mission successful, but god damn, that was annoying. Alright then. Any hoodles. That'll do it for the compound. Only three more to go. Almost there, friends. But until next time, I will see you then.